Hello everyone. Uh, this is uh, uh, Data Dawn. Okay, I'm in the data warehousing industry for the past 13 years. I'm just uh, gonna show you how to open the Control M scheduler, how to log in and open the same. Okay, let's go here, and then I'm talking about the Control M scheduler version 6.4, which has the web. Uh, uh, I mean web uh, web web option as well. Okay, so go to the uh, start menu. Uh, control M EM web launch and uh, Control M enterprise manager GUI. Okay, so click in there, okay. you will get a small login uh, uh, login window in which you just have to supply the username and password. So, this new version takes a little bit of time uh, to launch. Uh, I'm not sure, old version was much faster. Uh, this has like a lot of optimizer uh, added in, so it takes a lot of time. As you can see, it just says verifying application requirements. This may take a few moments. Okay, so once if that is done, uh, you'll get this login screen, uh, which would look like, uh, which will appear momentarily. It'll come up just now. So this is the control room, uh, enterprise manager login screen. It will ask for user, password, and then the server. So these are the servers that uh, uh, which are preloaded. If you want to load, add a new server, just click advanced and then put the server name and the default port name as uh, 13075. Okay. So if the server is already added, you just have to type in the username and password. I know the password as well, so it's just I'm just stopping that one. And this is the Control of Enterprise Manager QA. Okay. So to open the current actively running jobs, you just have to click open and then put all jobs. Like there are various options available. So I normally do all jobs or all active jobs, which will open all the jobs which is, which is scheduled to run today, which is active. Okay. So as you can see, this is the various windows. This is the tree view, wherein all the applications and the corresponding jobs will be there. And this is the neighborhood window, and this is like a minimized network overview window. Okay, so you can expand any of the two. So these are the various applications, and these are the jobs underneath that. Okay. So if I wanted to see any particular job, I'm just gonna open any one of the job, and then, and then you know, see the neighborhood. This job will show you. Uh, I mean, this will just show you the list of jobs, and you can see the predecessors and successors. So, if you open any application, uh, you can see all the jobs underneath that in a scheduled fashion. Okay. So, to view the property of any job, just double-click the job. You'll be able to see the property. And what is the you know what is the command name? What is the file path, etc. Okay, that's it guys. Thank you very much for watching my videos. Please subscribe for more tools and uh, techniques. Thanks, bye.